Click on the page and then I started my day If you ain't Vader, then get out of my face I'm watching Vader, so I'm feeling okay Vader Ooh. Oh my god, I can't believe Good morning guys, please excuse how I look right now. I just woke up, you know, this is how you look when you wake up. Y'all saw my last video, it was my week of workouts. been dying to know my routine and <clears throat> what workouts I do so if you're interested go watch that video Thursday because the videos I normally do like my vlogs and my like appointment videos all those kind of videos that I normally do do the best on my channel but like when I want to branch out and do other things it's so hard to like you know I feel like I have to kind of throw it <laughs> in people's faces like I posted a video hello you know but I mean when you go outside of your normal content, that shit tends to happen. I know it comes with it. It's just like kind of like, dang, like y'all were begging for this video. Like a lot of people was asking me about this video and my routines and y'all are not running it up. I mean, most of the people on my channel didn't come to see that, you know, it's just, I'm entering this new era and I really want to show you guys like, like me working out the gym, what I eat, like it's more of like a healthier lifestyle than just going out and vlogging and spending hella money. Like, it's not really realistic. You know, I actually wanna help people, you know? And I know I still help y'all, like, or just me making a video is helping y'all, but like, I wanna help you guys, like, in any way that I can, okay? But anyways, so today we're going to be doing a what I eat in a week. I'm actually starting this on a Tuesday because I just didn't think about vlogging yesterday or recording yesterday. I just, I don't know. I also had to work yesterday, so. But I did eat. And I just had breakfast and dinner for real because after work, I ate like two granola bars and I went to the gym. Yeah, I actually had a really good workout yesterday. It was interesting because this whole week or last week, I worked out with no energy drink and my skin has cleared up. Um, I still have a little bit of, you know, like little bumps here and there, but I think I need to wash my pillowcases. Uh, it was interesting, but yesterday was my best day without an energy drink. Like, I actually recommend it, you know, for the ones that have sensitive skin. I was drinking Celsius, so if you're noticing that, um, the more you drink it, just take a break from it <clears throat> and see if that's what you want to do, you know. But I'm about to make breakfast. It is... 11 16 i woke up a little bit later today i've been having a problem with my freaking throat i don't know what it is like it's just been like coughing like every day i'm this has never happened to me like i always like cough and then my nose starts getting like i start getting sick you know but i just have a cough like it's weird this morning we're going to make i think i want to make an egg sandwich because i had an egg sandwich yesterday and it was really good so i'm going to take out the ingredients and we're gonna make this egg sandwich also i don't have like a lined up meal plan just whatever like i feel like cooking that day i have a couple recipes that i recently like learned or whatever and they're pretty like filling meals yeah i've just been trying to eat a little bit more because i don't I don't eat, okay? And the only way I'm gonna gain is if I eat, right? Okay. I'm gonna take my ingredients out. Okay, so since, since we don't have bacon, since we don't have bacon, I'm just going to use this turkey breast, okay? You're just gonna put it on the pan, give it a little burn, and this is gonna go in our egg sandwich. I'm using spinach also to put in my eggs for you know a vegetable one thing i definitely struggled with growing up is eating vegetables like i did not eat vegetables babe like you could not get me to eat vegetables now that i know the importance of eating a vegetable every day like with your meals with your full meal i kind of had to force myself to do it but now i know how to cook them and make them taste good so now that they're more enjoyable you know so yeah just a little fun fact about me, I don't like vegetables, but I like spinach because you can't taste it, 
this is the bread that I use. This is potato bread. I love this bread. Um, my mom used to have this bread at the house, so when I moved out, I just kept buying it because this bread is just so good. Like, the loaves are thick, it's soft, it doesn't taste like a potato. It's just, it just tastes so good. Like, y'all should try potato bread, for real. I'm going to mix up my eggs. Okay y'all, so it's a little bit later. Um, yeah, it's a little bit later and I've washed my hair. I'm gonna be doing a braid out, so that's why my hair is in like these, it's so bright. Anyways, I didn't eat my banana this morning, so I'm about to eat that. And it's two o'clock, it's 2.10, I'm already hungry a little bit. So I'm gonna make tuna. That's my favorite like snack lunch you know quick little thing to make and i just eat it with these crackers or you can make a sandwich with like provolone cheese but i don't do that anyways i'm gonna eat this banana and i'm gonna make that because i'm about to be on the way to a lash appointment yeah i'll just eat it on the way banana it's really good also i started buying these big um water jugs and i try to finish them within two days you know sometimes it doesn't work out like that but bananas and water is not a good combination i just can't drink water after eating a banana but we're gonna drink hella water today this is all i drunk yesterday we need to get it together but i'm just thinking like i don't know if i'm ready for like a full because twin is really filling i'm not that hungry i'll probably just eat some snacks before my appointment and then because i'm going to the gym after so i'll go to the gym and then i'll make like a snack i don't know why where is this like dots of lighter skin coming from um like discoloration not really cute bro i have been using this turmeric soap mm. anyways done with my banana i'm about to see if i could drink this water like i literally do not like drinking water after eating a banana or certain things it's just like gross ew but um <laughs> these nature valley nature nature valley sweet and salty nut chewy granola bars the cashew ones are so good these are like my favorite little bars granola bars to eat this is what it looks like it's so good bro like these best snack throughout the day i love these but yeah i'm not gonna make tuna i'm gonna just do like little snacks and then later i will show y'all what we're making for dinner because i'm not gonna i'm probably gonna be hungry though before the gym i'm trying to think like what should i do but for right now banana granola bar yeah it is so cold today it's 32 degrees outside the tea tay we're gonna get yeah hey, i'm about to go I'm about to go to my lash appointment. I'm just gonna take you guys with me because I might as well just vlog this whole week and make it like a week in my life plus like a what I eat in a week, you know? It just, it doesn't, I don't know. Because I'm such a vlogger, like I just still vlog whenever the fuck. I forgot to bring my water, but 
I'm not going back inside. It's too cold. Yeah, but I'm gonna get to my appointment. Shut up. To my appointment five minutes early. So let's go. Hey guys, we made it to the one and only. Period. Actually, it wasn't in traffic at all on the way here. It just, for some reason, took that long. I don't know. Hello. Hello. And the four agreements uh, reveals the. Hey. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Hey y'all, my lashes are done. It is 5.14, I am definitely hungry. All I had was breakfast, so I am trying not to eat out. But I mean, it's looking like that's the only choice because, you know, I'm not at home. So I'm gonna go to this Wendy's, get me something to eat um, because I have like a 30 minute drive back home and like, oh, actually I have a 43 minute drive back home. So I won't get home until about like six o'clock. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat. And I'll probably hit the gym a little bit later today, so. At least my lashes look good. I love them. Thank you for choosing Wendy's. Hi, um, can I get um, a number five? Number five, the grilled chicken wrap, yes. What's your drink? Um, can I get a strawberry lemonade? Yes, would that be all for you tonight? Yes, that's it. Your total is 1101, thank you. Okay, thank you. Hello, 1101. Uh -huh. Thank you. Can I get sweet and sour sauce, please? Thank you. Baby. Yes. Get back tomorrow for you, huh? Mm hmm I bet you won't say die cock no more. I mean, I'm not mad. You be mad at me. <laughs> yeah, we about to eat. I look like a little boy, bro, with these birds in my hand. If y'all don't eat sweet and sour sauce with your fries from Wendy's, mm mm. Baby. Mm -hmm. You're juvenile a lot every single day. Did y'all shit making that sound? I'm kind of a K5. I'm fucking ground. to the gym i'm gonna change my shoes real quick i'm gonna change in there because it is extremely cold outside it's literally 28 degrees like what the heck people are literally running because it's that cold i should have brought a second jacket this is what i wore today these are so cute i got these from forever 21 but they are too small for me literally like i thought i grabbed the right size and i had long pants on that day so i couldn't really tell I am back home from the gym and to make my protein shake that I always make after the gym. This definitely helps me gain weight, okay? This is like definite help, okay? So I don't know if you guys used to watch when I first started making my protein shakes, but I used to put a lot of protein powder and I used to make a different recipe, but that's also effective too. I just don't do that recipe anymore because like I constantly had to keep buying fruit. Like it was just like pretty easy. The re the ingredients last me a long enough time. Y'all have seen me make this shake so many times. Sar. Also, please excuse my hair. Because it's so chopped, it won't stay in a braid. So I got rods after I left the gym, like little flexi rods. I'm 
or like the little rods to wrap my hair and then I'm gonna tie it down and put it in a bonnet tonight and then I'll take them out tomorrow. Um, also, we did arm day and I really feel like I did a lot. We didn't even do that many workouts, but like my arms are so freaking tight. Like, Mocha's over here eating a little bone. But yeah, we did arms and abs and then we ran for 0.25 miles. So what you're gonna need is some oats first. Oats, okay. Peanut butter. I like this brand. This is forever my favorite brand. You're gonna need your choice of protein powder. This is by far my favorite protein powder literally ever. This is the GNC Weight Gainer. Um, You can use the whey protein so, but I like this one and I feel like it's effective. It's also a weight gainer. So like it's helping me gain weight. This is what I use. It says for this weight gainer that you can um, supplement it for like a meal and mix four scoops into a 16 ounce, into 16, 16 ounces of water and you can consume it two times a day. So this I would recommend with like fruit smoothies or anything, you can literally add this and whatever also the weight the whey protein you can do that too i think i'm gonna revert to that one after this one just so i can see like the differences for real because i'm only using one scoop for this recipe so i feel like i could be gaining a little bit more the flavor that i get is vanilla ice cream this is my freaking favorite i love it but yeah then you're gonna need honey and some cinnamon almond milk and ice and i'm gonna put some ice in this first this is about enough ice you need. I don't even measure this anymore because I'm so used to doing it now. Oats, now peanut butter. I like colors. I like colors. Yep, then I go in with my protein powder. I didn't want to do two scoops of this, but we're just going to do... And I do one cup of milk. You guys can drink this multiple times a day. I only do once after the gym, but I love you want to start doing it <coughs> twice a day. Did you fart? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> y'all i am out of the shower and we're about to make dinner i already started i'm not gonna lie i forgot i was filming but i seasoned my chicken already i'm actually cooking for me and my man we got some chicken in here um this is the oil it's kind of they said you could use old oil it's not even that old I, it's like a couple days old so we're gonna use it whatever but i have my bread crumb bread crumbs here and then i have some flour and i seasoned the chicken with adobo garlic powder um onion powder smoked paprika and what else i used some of this creole seasoning actually no i didn't put that in there today but yeah i'm actually gonna season my flour a little bit trust me it's, it makes a difference you know just a little bit just a wee bit so yeah, we're making um, avocado lime. We're making wraps, okay? Y'all gonna see me make a wrap. Now I'm gonna make the egg wash. It's your bowl. And then you're gonna season your eggs with like all the seasonings that you put on your chicken. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of Parmesan cheese. All right, so we got our egg wash, breadcrumbs, our flour, and our chicken. So I'm now just waiting for this to heat up. It looks <laughs> gross, actually. It's, we looked it up on Google and it said it's okay to use the oil you now, so. But yeah, these are the flour tortillas that I'm using. Yeah, this is really my favorite meal to make. It's pretty quick, pretty easy. Um, you can either use lettuce or spinach in your wrap whatever you want i like lettuce but he likes spinach i'll probably do both in his and i'll just do lettuce in mine but yeah and then <laughs> this this is the rice that i use i just use this ready rice roasted chicken to put in the wrap this is really good with it too um and then this is the ranch 
It's seeming like it's hot already. Let's try to put one in there. This is really all we need, but these two are probably gonna be for like, if we want to eat tomorrow. But yeah, you wanna make sure your chicken is pretty golden. You don't have to put it on a high heat. I actually turned it down because I think I had it too high, but yeah. Oh yeah, pour that thing. And there we go. This is his plate. I'm about to make my plate. Literally, it's falling off the plate because it's so big. But he requested, <laughs> sorry. He requested two loaded wraps, okay? So that's what he's gonna get. Now we finna make mine. All that damn food in my I don't know what you saying. I'm gonna find the best. It's good, y'all. Okay, good. Morning. Good morning. Right, here she go, bro. You, you just had to come room it, huh? Good morning, y'all. So it's the next day and I'm about to make breakfast. I've been up for a while. I've been up for a while, but I gotta face this way because the light ain't be messing up. I've been up for a while, like a little bit, but I'm just not about to eat. I had to make an appointment for like a doctor's appointment. And yeah, it's 11. Yesterday I had breakfast at 11. But I'm basically about to make the same. Hold on. But yeah, I'm basically about to make the same breakfast I had yesterday. But we don't have spinach because we used all the spinach for our wrap last night. So we're just gonna eat. We're just gonna make the eggs without the spinach. Because that was a pretty good breakfast, okay? So there's mochi mochi. I really want to charge my other camera battery because I miss how wide the angle was. Y'all also, um, I went to the store and I put the rods at the end of my hair. I took them out when I woke up, but now the ends are curly. I can't wait to take this out. I might take it out on camera because I want to see how cute it's going to look. I'm going to go to the store today and get some stuff. Like, even though we literally went to the grocery store and bought everything we needed for this week, still need more shit. It's Peter Dillon. Oh, y'all, sometimes, like, when I have, like, my bacon and I make eggs, um, these bagels are 12, 12 grams of protein. Somebody has said something in my comments about them actually being 12, 12 grams of whole grains, but it says 12 grams of protein right here. These are the, um, Dave's, the Dave's killer bread brand i got this from walmart i'm pretty sure they have them in like other places too but these are so good definitely recommend these i think i'm gonna make this tomorrow when i go to the store and get bacon and stuff
so I'm about to be on the way to the store now. I just need to get like a couple things so that I can cook for the rest of the week. And I'm not gonna lie, this is so weird like making like a different video out of like what I'm used to doing. So it's like I wanna record everything but I wanna make sure like I'm still focusing on the main topic of this video which is showing y'all like meals that I eat throughout the day so that I can gain weight and um you know just instead of eating out too much for real but like i just wanted to show y'all that like even like realistically like sometimes i eat out you know like i'm just trying to be like realistic and not just show y'all shit because you know like it looks good like it looks good for me to be eating healthy like sometimes yeah sometimes i eat out but like i try to eat shit that's like kind of healthy you know like the wrap that i had yesterday was like low-key healthy it had chicken lettuce I forgot what else was in it but it was like kind of like a healthier like choice to eat but um i'm also gonna get the recipe or the ingredients that i had and i was making my smoothies back then because i used to make some bomb ass smoothies and they were so good and i want to you know like start that up again i was literally just talking to y'all about that but i definitely want to get ingredients for that and do that yeah we're about to go to target i have to go to the gym around four well around like five basically so i have time to go to the store come back put the stuff back get ready for the gym and then head out we're going to target i haven't been to target in such a long time i really have been trying not to spend my money i've been trying to save and you know i don't really go out for real and spend money you know but we're gonna go to target and see what we get so i will see you guys at target hey guys so i'm in target and um <laughs> i'm getting spinach and bacon only and bro i literally haven't been to the store in forever bro i'm in the makeup section right now because oh um, i don't really know oh my god you know what i'm not gonna get it but yeah, I'm really only here for two things. And I ended up in the makeup and hair section. I know, baby. <laughs> Bye. Oh, you want to do? <laughs> no. So Target didn't have um, the bacon that I wanted, so I'm about to go to Publix real quick and see if I can get it there. If not, I'm just gonna go to Kroger later after the gym because I'm not gonna keep going to these different stores because I can't find the bacon that I want. But there's a specific bacon that I like. Yeah, I'm not gonna switch it up or anything. Yep, we're on the way to Publix, so I will see you guys at Publix. <laughs> Okay guys, so I have made it back home and I'm about to make my smoothie. I'm gonna make the smoothie first and then I'm gonna make some tuna or I might eat my leftover wrap from last night cause I didn't finish it because I had my protein shake and then I was trying to eat that and it was, I wasn't, no. <laughs> this is the fruit that I'm using. I have mango chunks here, pineapple chunks and passion fruit tropical blend. I'm literally putting all of that into the cup. And then this is the juice that I'm using. Delicious. You can also use passion fruit, which I actually like better. I have that. I might use it. We'll see. Let's go ahead and put the fruit. It's not really frozen anymore because it took me a minute to get home. Now that we got our fruit, I'm going to put juice. Yeah, we're just gonna go with peach. And then I'm going to put my protein powder in here. I'm just gonna do a scoop and a half. Some agave. And just some ice. this cup because I ran out of lids for my Amazon cups that I have. Oh my god. Y'all, it's so 
good. This is a lot, but. Mm. What the fuck? And there we have our smoothie. Bro. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So it is dinner time. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I can't even explain to y'all the shit that just happened, okay? I just freaked the fuck out, okay? And we had like a little bit of a scare. My eyes are puffy because I was freaking the fuck out. I'm about to make dinner. It is 10.33. We're starting late because obvious reasons, you know? I'm just so thrown off. Anyways, I'm about to make rice and salmon. He's gonna make the salmon because he makes it amazingly, okay? He's in the shower right now. Um, But yeah, about to make rice and salmon. My eyes are so heavy. And I just got my lashes done. Crying when you just get your lashes done. Anyways, let's, let's do this shit, bro. Cause I'm literally over it tonight. I got this recipe for the rice off of TikTok. I love this recipe. Like, I feel like the way I was making rice before is not topping this like at all. I just used the jasmine um, rice from Publix. You're gonna need garlic. I like this minced garlic. Just put a little bit of that. Just a little bit. Um, salt and pepper. Um, and you're gonna need some oil. I forgot to show y'all me making the sauce, but all I did was put garlic, put oil, garlic in the pan, and then I put this heavy whipping cream, and then I put all my seasonings, and I put Parmesan cheese and mozzarella cheese. So, and the sauce goes in the rice. And then our green beans are still in there. Salmon is still going. Hello guys, so it is the next day. I didn't film this morning, it's 3.23, but I didn't film this morning because I had a doctor's appointment and that took up most of the morning. Also, I was rushing with breakfast, so I just ended up eating a bagel. Like I had a whole bagel and a granola bar and a banana. So yeah, but yeah, so I, after that, I went home and I like did some laundry. I came to this bookstore to edit because I've been enjoying, you know, like going to a bookstore and actually editing. It's so much more peaceful than like Starbucks, which I don't go to anymore. So much more peaceful than Starbucks and like Dunkin' or whatever. But yeah, that's where I edit now and I didn't film because I was using this SD card. But anyways, all that to say, now I'm starting the vlog for today. 
I'm about to go home and figure out something to eat because I'm about to go to the gym soon. Um, tonight, I'm not sure what we're making for dinner because we already made all of our favorites. I could make pasta tonight because I did get um, noodles, the pasta noodles for, you know, when I make it. But I do have leftovers from yesterday, so I could just make like chicken. Like, it really depends for real. I really want to show y'all like different meals, but at the same time, I don't want to just make all this extra food. You know, when we have like leftovers, you know, so I could really for lunch eat the leftovers. I did have a piece of fish left, so I could just eat that. But yeah, we might make pasta tonight. We'll see. I have made pasta on my channel before and I showed y'all and it's so good. It's a chicken alfredo pasta. But yeah, I think that's what we're going to eat tonight. Last night, oh my God, the dinner was amazing. That rice, that salmon. I'm telling y'all if y'all eat like this oh my gosh this is what i wanted to tell you guys because i went to the doctor i went to my obgyn no the fuck i went to my um i went to my gynecologist today y'all so first of all i didn't even tell y'all when i first weighed myself i was at the gym with cc and we like we had went to the gym together like i didn't weigh myself because i was stuck at 118 for so long y'all not even 118 like 115 to 118 like when i was in high school when i had just got out like every time i weighed myself it was the same weight i mean i also wasn't doing anything for me to gain weight but like i was so tired of seeing that number and that's why i started working out because i wanted to gain weight and i felt like i was just so skinny you know even when i started working out i never weighed myself because i was so afraid that i would see the same weight and it would just like the same number and i feel like it would discourage me you know like i just feel like it would discourage me in the gym so I just never would check it so when me and cc went to the gym that day they had like a scale and i think it was her that was just like let's just weigh ourselves or i just did it it was next to like the sink when you wash your hands so i was like okay bro. so i got on it i literally saw that it said 129 or 128 like, i have a picture y'all when i tell y'all like i have never felt so like i felt like it was a reward because i knew that i was like pushing myself and like doing what i needed to do to gain weight but i just never wanted to see like the number because i'm like okay it probably didn't even change that much but going from 118 or 115 to whatever i was at to seeing 129 or 128 whatever it is such like it was like dang like wait are you really like doing your thing and I struggled for so long y'all gaining weight literally I struggled so long and I was determined to gain like I was determined y'all see my results I know at first y'all probably like what you know like I was like what is she talking about like she's not even gaining but because I look at myself every day I see myself every day even when I look back at like old pictures it's just like dang like I really gained and I really did this you know what I'm saying like for myself i can put like a before and after picture just to show y'all like the differences because there is some major differences and i'm also very i'm like stronger now also my core is stronger like girl i never used to be able to do five push-ups now i can do like over 10 push-ups that's just like a small you know like milestone for real to hit but like yeah like i just want to tell y'all like no matter what literally no matter what just keep going for real and like you have to literally want that shit you feel me like you have to want to be better you have to want to change you can't just sit and just be like oh my gosh you just can't just sit and complain all day like you have to get up every single day and work towards your goal i didn't have a set goal or set weight that i wanted i just knew that i wanted to gain weight and i feel like that was better for me because i feel like when you set like a if you want like a certain number it's like it drives you crazy with like weight you know because it's like you want to get to this number so bad you keep checking you keep checking if you're at that weight like no I never set that goal for that reason because I know how I am. Like, I'm going to be not defeated, but I'm going to feel, like, set back, you know, if I keep seeing the number that I don't want to see. I don't know. It just helps me to not set a weight goal, you know, just to see the progress. I literally just want to see, like, the progress. I don't care what my end goal 
my end weight is like I just want to see the progress anyways so today when I went to the doctor I am now at 131 pounds I when I seen that I was just like wow like even though it's probably like two pounds more than the last one it's just like I actually got to that point I never saw myself I'm telling y'all I never saw myself getting past 118 getting past 120 like I really gained for real and it just took time you know I'm just so grateful and I know that you guys can do it too and I know there's a lot of y'all watching and y'all want to gain weight you want to get in the gym but you're just scared like trust me I was that girl before and I was scared as fuck to get in the gym I hated vegetables I hated not hated but like I just didn't eat a lot I just felt like dang like I don't eat a lot so I'm never gonna gain like there's just so many there was so many excuses I was making for myself and one day I was just like bro who gives a fuck if these people are staring at me in the gym I feel like nobody in the gym can judge you nobody anywhere can judge you don't feed into like people staring like just you really just have to let go i know y'all have anxiety i had i have anxiety sometimes in like social settings or whatever and it's like you're learning like you're gonna get to that point one day where you just walk in the gym you're confident and you're just doing your thing like some you literally have to start somewhere i'm telling you like i used to be in the corner of the gym too girl with my mat doing all of my exercises like i did not want to ask nobody like oh how many sets you got left on this machine or like you know like i just didn't want to be in the main area because i felt like everybody was looking at me but it's like girl like who cares you're in that gym to work on yourself so don't listen to what anybody else has to say like don't feed into the stairs i know there's weird men out there that be staring at you girl you just gotta learn to block that stuff out and it's really i feel like one of my like crazy talents is i can literally block out the entire world like i can literally be in my own world and there'll be so many people around me i mastered that because i never used to be like that i used to just care about what everybody else around me thought but now when i be in that gym it's literally me me versus me in that damn gym all of that basically to say like just keep going y'all i love y'all so much you got this even if you, you're trying to lose weight like you got this bro you have to start somewhere stop making excuses for yourself like just think about it this way if you're in a situation situation where you get caught on fire or your hands on fire your head is on fire whatever you're gonna do everything in your power everything in your power to get out of that situation right so that's how we need to start treating our goals you have a dream right if you treat it like that scenario where you do anything in your power to get it you're going to get it like there's no choice because you're doing everything you need to do you're getting your ass up you're putting your mind to it you're, you know what i'm saying like all of that if you do that there's no way that you cannot reach that goal but a lot of y'all just be scared and that's being scared and having fear is what literally stops people from reaching their goals for real this clip is long enough i love y'all see y'all at the house y'all i kid you not i have been trapped been traffic i've been in traffic for an hour it was supposed to take me 18 minutes or 20 minutes to get home it's been an hour because i don't know what is going on traffic is one mile per hour literally and i don't know because i'm really finna all the cars are like going on the the side lane and shit and i'm really about to do it like i can't stand people that do that because it'd be a lot of accidents that happen that way but like i'm hungry it is five o'clock i left that bookstore at like 3 25 3 30 why is it taking so freaking long bro there has to be an accident but it's like i don't know like my patience is wearing thin and i'm hungry so it's just not a good mix but my exit is coming up i'm so close we're almost there we just gotta get through it <sighs> i'll update you guys in a minute Devoured. 
work in literally 10 minutes. Girl. I'm not even gonna lie, y'all. I don't even know if I'm going to the gym right now. I am gonna get ready and then go. It's just so much traffic right now. I low-key want to wait it out, but at the same time, I don't want to wait too late to go to the gym. Yeah, but I had my lunch, my late lunch. It's 6 o'clock, babe. I'm going to take that out, but that burp was 11. I'm not even supposed to be drinking juice, but anyways, I'm about to eat a lemon slice for my dessert since I ate all my food. I be so proud of myself. Mm. I really shouldn't eat this before the gym, but... If you want to know what a motherfucking boss looks like, bitch, you looking at one. A bitch that handles big business. <laughs> With the love of their life who feel what I feel when I'm with you, with you, with you. Y'all, I'm making a sandwich. I had my protein shake. I didn't even drink all of it, to be honest. I didn't even bring, I mean, I didn't buy almond milk today, so I had to make my smoothie. What's up, Mike? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My chick house if you want. Wait, yeah. Okay guys, so unfortunately I had a baby. That's the end of the video, y'all. Um I definitely have more meals I could show y'all that I make, but this video is gonna be so long. So I'm gonna just do like a separate video or like another video in the future of me showing you guys like different meals. Mostly this is what we eat throughout the week. We'll just repeat literally everything. Um, sometimes we try different things. Like it just really depends, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you learned something. I hope I helped, you know, I just really hope that I reach at least one person, you know, and you guys try these meals out um i would definitely say the salmon and rice is my favorite i could eat that probably every day but yeah i love you guys so much um and i will see you in my next video